In this video I want to share with you my recommendations on how to learn a language. I've taught myself Spanish from scratch, didn't learn in school, and at the moment I'm uh, learning how to speak Japanese. So I want to share with you what I think is the fastest, best, like most time effective way to learn a language. So in the first time I learned Spanish I studied loads of uh, grammar. I studied the high school like six year curriculum of grammar. And uh, this time speaking Japanese, I I could have done a bit better, and that's why I'm making this video. But this time learning Japanese, I learned much faster than the, my first attempt at learning a language myself. So, what's really really important is you want to learn like basically instead of like studying the grammar like extensively, which is what I did, but almost like two times. Um, what you want to do is you want to do a mix and the most important things you want to learn are basically the most common verbs like 20, 30, 40, 50, just a lot of the common verbs like to go, to leave. So you want to say like I go, I leave. So you want to learn the words like you, he, she, um, they, I, they're obviously the most common. Basically speaking, you want for value for money, value for time, you want to learn what's most applicable and usable for speaking, okay? So it's not about writing, it's not about reading, it's basically about communicating and um, expressing yourself and getting points across and even understanding some words. So you want to learn you know, basic verbs and you want to learn basic vocabulary. So words like house, um, town, food, drink, um, whatever topic you most talk about, you learn about that. Maybe, for example, stuff like mother, father, um, shops, family, where is, um, when, if, also, to, maybe, um, lot, um, always, forever. I've written down a few things like today. I'm just trying to like really improve my Japanese. So. Still, everywhere, another day, only. Um, and the most verbs that you find, like just to leave, go, eat, drink, buy, think, to know, like I'd say I know, or little expressions like more or less, um, sure, good day, good morning, good night. So you want the most common things you use regularly. So don't make the mistake of studying too much verb, too much of something. Grammar is like the verbs and vocabulary is like your arm, for example, the physical object. And grammar is a bit like energy that moves and uses the physical object. So grammar is like how you use and express yourself with the vocabulary and verbs that you know. So this is, I'm on the beautiful island of La Palma in the Canary Islands. I just I won't get off track, but just to share the beautiful area where I am, nice tree. But yeah, I encourage you just to like write down and what you need to do is you need to make, be okay with making mistakes. You need to repeat, practice, repeat, practice, repeat, practice, go over, like write down all these words, go over the pages like regularly every day or most days of the week, write down new common vocabulary and verbs, practice, try and speak with somebody and then little by little you string together sentences like for example, um, I want to say to my beautiful partner tomorrow, only want to eat fruits or every day I want to give you massages you know so you learn little by little like the verb to massage to you every day or and all sort of things like next week last week this year so that's how you do it basically speaking for example the Michelle Thomas method which I'm learning um, Japanese it's very good but it focuses too heavily on grammar in my opinion way too much it doesn't teach you enough v verbs or vocabulary by a long way so it's you really 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 want to um, study that yourself verbs and vocabulary is essential um, so grammar is, is probably least important almost but it's important you need to have some grammar for sure it's very important but you really 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 need to learn the, the words like I was saying like even Monday to Friday and some numbers and so you can express time or and um, that's also very important um, and once you basically speak once you can slam down like a few hundred words or a thousand or more like the common vocabulary and verbs you can basically communicate anything you want like words like a tree air sun 
the weather, hot, cold, I want. So anyway, I'll leave you with that, but I hope this video helps, and I hope you liked it, and if you liked it, I appreciate any shares or likes or comments, and thank you, have a lovely day, and I'll see you again in another video. Many blessings, and see you soon.